well, there's 18 other drummers. And I make a choice on a song, and, they, and Kathy said, well, unfortunately, you know, Kenny's doing that, or uh, uh, Dave Weckl is doing that one. I said, well, how about this one? Oh, sorry, Steve, Sm Steve Smith wants to do that one. So I went, ah, oh, OK, you know. So the list sort of diminishes, and of course, I, it's been a long time, really, since I've listened, sat down and listened to Buddy Rich records. Um, so they sent me some stuff, and it was really weird hearing it again after so long. And knowing what I would have to do, because obviously I can't play like Buddy, so we, I'm sure all of us, we approach it our own way. You have to have a vehicle that it works really well. So it was interesting trying to choose the right songs, and uh, the band were, were absolutely wonderful. Um, and after a sort of couple of takes, you sort of get into the environment again. But it was very, very strange. After so many years of playing with like a loud bass player and a guitar player and a keyboard player and playing left-handed, because I used to play right-handed years ago and that's when I learned to play sort of that sort of music, but I've never played it left-handed. So it was quite an experience. It was very strange. Um, and it took a little bit of getting used to, and I'm sure I'm going to be thinking about that for a while, but a very unique experience. Uh, and it was, it was wonderful. Come and listen. You sound like a, like a storm. <laughs>